Hello, and welcome to Archvaldus Hacks with Archvaldus and his amazing hacks. In my recent leveling video, I mentioned a very powerful method where a high level monk would put down an ox statue and draw aggro from all mobs in range. Then a low level character would DPS these mobs down. And this method is exceptionally powerful. A skill team can easily get a player to level 60 in as little as 10 hours a fraction of the time it takes to level via dungeons or quests. Now, while this method has proven very popular, some expressed dissatisfaction that this technique was only accessible to multiple players, or players with a second account. Now, that's not actually the case. It is possible to do this with one account, and this short video will show you exactly how to do this. I'm going to go deliberately slowly here so you can see exactly what I'm doing. First, I'd recommend doing a test run in a location with no hostile mobs so you can focus on the mechanics involved. I'm going to be using two characters in Stormwind. To begin with, load up two different World of Warcraft clients. That's two versions of World of Warcraft. The two characters I'll be using for this video are my mage Archvalda and my monk Miliaris. I'm going to log in first on Miliaris, and once I've logged in, I put down an ox statue. Now, I switch over to the second client and log in on Archvalda. Note that this is on the same account. Also, now that we don't log out on Miliaris, we just log straight in on Archvalda. And you can see when we log in on Archvalda, there is Miliaris, the monk, standing motionless next to her statue. Now, we can't control Miliaris at all. We see her as we would see any other player or NPC from the perspective of Archvelda. If you look at the client we use to log in on Miliaris, you see this error message. But it's not important, just ignore it. What matters is that Miliaris's form and her statue remain in the game world, motionless, for one minute. A lot of people mention this error message when they try to get this to work and think they can't. In fact, if you've got this to work properly, then this error message will appear. So this part of the video is just to illustrate the basic concept involved. Now I'm going to show you an actual example of how to grind experience in-game using this method. By the way, you don't need to level a monk to use this method you can use a class trial. Now, I'm going to be logging into my account again, and I'm going to be calling up two different clients. Now, this time I'm going to log in on my monk, Salathis. And uh, we're at the same location in the ruins of Karabor in Shadow Moon Valley that I used in my leveling video. It's very rich with these demon hunter mobs. So Salathis puts down her statue, all the demon hunter mobs attack it, and we log in on the second client, and this time we're going to log in on my warrior Carnalius. I'm going to emphasize we don't log out on Salathis, we just log straight in on the second client. Carnalius now attacks the demon hunter mobs that have been effectively pacified by Salathis's statue. Carnalius has just under a minute to kill all these mobs before Salathis and her statue vanish from the game. But that's more than enough time as these demon hunter mobs have quite low health. With tougher mobs, such as the ones I showed in Blackrock Stronghold earlier, you may need to log in on your monk multiple times to refresh the statue. So if you like this video, why not consider joining my super secret Patreon feed, where hacks too hot for YouTube get posted the second I come up with them. Thanks for watching, this has been Archvalda.